Hey guys, and thanks for clicking on the video. I'm Zemek playing some Garchomp in the center lane. We're running these items and these emblems. I hope I am. Because this Goomy decided that he also wanted to go into the center lane. And he got the... I, I called it first, my dude. Now we both don't evolve. I hope you're happy. I really do. This is awesome. I, I just love it when people take the stuff, the lane that you hold. Alright. Well, now neither of us evolve. I don't get into cool gank. He's actively throwing the game. It's pretty... It's it's, it's tight. It's fine. We're in duo queue. We're in duo queue. Amateus is playing Mega Mewtwo Y in the top lane. Let's see, they jump on him and I'm here too. And now we both die. Mostly because I wasn't a Gabite. This is so much fun. Like how I've been playing solo queue the last couple of videos, and then as soon as we get like an extra teammate, then all of a sudden people start to do shenanigans that happened in season one. <clears throat> Alright, there's our evolution. We can play. <clears throat> Why didn't it? Oh, because of its passive. It's cheat passive. You love that. You know, I use an entire ability to drag the Glaceon towards the middle to kill it. And it doesn't even have to do anything. Fighting on our gold pad is a good idea. Unfortunately, they have a Greninja who's almost level 8 now. This, this Gudrez really ticks me off. Well, there's a Reggie in the bottom that's about to spawn. <laughs> Got it! Let's go! Had almost no confirmed power there. I'm gonna start shredding this Aleki. If our team is able to get the uh, gold broken before that, great. If not, oh well. I need my Garchomp. There it is. Cinderace needed backup, but I need this farm. Like the first time I have both buffs the entire game. Now. Ugh. 
So I brought him closer to the Cinderace, which was probably a mistake, but at least I did tank for it. At least there was that. There's a Reggie in the bottom we need to go to. I still have my Unite move, which is good. Gonna need it this fight, I think. like we pushed him back. There's a number on. And this was my last chance to unite, so I don't feel bad about it at all. That was a pretty good wipe. Held it in place for the Cinderace, and that's a crash for Lecky. And a lot of CC coming through. Oh, I mean, look, Umbreon. Oh my gosh, my HP just had a tug of war to end all tug of wars. Yeah, we take their farm and leave. We were barely able to beat that without them having healing. There's no way we want to do it with them healing on their mangle. Yeah, why would a guard chomp want the red buff? Good point, Meowskarada. The reason why I'm taking time to farm right now when there's a fight down there was because I need my Unite move back. I cannot go into the final fight without my Unite move. Okay, I know where four of them are. I'll take those odds. Not sure why my team didn't come to Reggie Steel, but that's all right because Garchomp is pretty good at bursting these. Just enough time. But that also got us out level 14. Hey, okay, Blastoise. Who is attacking it? Please tell me it wasn't that Meowstrad. I think there's no reason to be attacking it. Oh gosh, I almost united there in the mean look. That would have been pretty bad. Or maybe not bad at all. It's fine. Well, with this cursed team, starting with the Gudra, we were able to get a pretty convincing win anyways. Oh, I don't get an MVP now. Didn't get the 100 in. I don't know, I might not have gotten it to begin with. But now I don't have a chance. I would call stealing somebody's lane bot behavior, but like bots don't do that. They'll turn around for you. Yeah, I don't I don't believe that MVP for a second. I'm salty. It's alright. This that's what the uh report button is for to get all of the salt out for next round. So you're not salty anymore. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Until then, bye.